Hi guys, welcome to Tech Tutorial Guide. In this video, now I'm going to show you how to install Remix OS, which is based on Android. So before installation, so let we need to know about the Remix OS. So while comparing with BlueStacks and UI, which is uh, giving the lots of customization and UI, while comparing with BlueStacks and UI. So before installation, you might need some of the requirements. So you need the USB drive. So we are installing and keeping our Android OS in USB. So because we are plugging play the Android using a USB drive. So before installation, you must have USB 3.0 or lower. For better performance, you need the USB 3.0 pen drive, which having the writing speed 20 MB per second or higher to get the nice performance. So you don't install it on your computer. So let's you need to you can carry the Android OS in pen drive. So if you want to install it on your portable hard drive and so you can try and you can keep your Android in the portable hard drive as well. So here you can find the multitasking feature. So the this would be the UA of the Remix OS. So you don't have to install any kinds of drivers to support the Wi-Fi. So because it will pre-built in this Remix OS. So let's I will show you how to install. After downloading the Remix OS, you can find the .dr files of 622 megabytes. So just right click on it. So extract it to Remix OS for PC. So let you can find out this folder and double click on it. So we can find out the Remix OS .iso file that is on disk image file and the Remix OS we will be creating tool. So before that, what we have to do means we need to format our pen drive with FAT32 format. So just click on format. And select the file 32 as default because it won't the remix is only supporting the file 32 file system. Just select start so and you can find out the warning format when it is your data. If you have any sensitive data on your environment, then backup to another drive, either our local drive D or C. So now you can find the format has been completed. So just click on the properties. So here you can find out the File system would be as FAT32. So double click on this USB creating tool and access the user and give the permission as S. Now close this window in here. Select the ISO file which you have extracted to specified folders and found find out your path of your Linux OS. So just double click on it and it will automatically select the USB disk. Just click OK. Now it will be extract start the extracting copying files so then after it will install the bootloader and then after it will ask to reboot our system so it may take it depends on your usb performance so we need to wait until to completing this process
now click on reboot system now to boot in to boot your usb pen drive type f12 or or else f12 or f10 or f9 keys so most of the devices having the f2 escape or delete keys or either f8 so let's we can find out here we have two options guest mode and resident modes in guest mode no data will be saved so in resident mode all your data has been saved so let's we will check it out with guest mode so let's hit enter so here you can find detecting in an x86 So here the booting logo remix OS. So you don't need to install it on your PC so it, you can carry the Android OS in your USB so you can use it on any hardware. So it might need the hardware requirement so it will support on any hardware. So it will pre-build with it having the pre-built drivers. So Wi-Fi and Bluetooth work automatically. So first boot will taking a uh, some amount of time. So let's you have to be patient to I don't disturb the USB pen drive. So because it will be working with the pen drive alarm. So because it's supporting live USB. So I think boot time has been completed. I think so. So here it will begin the setup screen. So at the corner you can find the guest mode that will set as your data while restarting your dev PC. So in resident mode your device will be your data will be saved in inside the pen drive. So here click on next. So now I'm selecting English United State. Select user agreements and click on next. And if you have in Wi-Fi means it will automatically detect it here so let's we already know so just click on skip and it will be showing your resurrect remix voice is ready so click on start so here guys it would be the UI of this remix voice so let me I will show you the task manager so let we already seen so here you can find the what Android version we have so just click on settings and about tape android version so here we having android lollipop